Using a closed polyline, create an L shape. Add a fix constraint and create two circles. Add some horizontal constraints and vertical constraints. Add some radius constraints Right click, add a new parameter, change the name to hole and the expression to 1.5 Now change the expression of the two radius constraints to hole Right click and animate Now add linear constraints as shown and change the names. Right click and select animate to understand the behaviour of these new constraints. Create an array. There should be three columns, space 10 apart, and one row, space 10 apart. Create another array. Two rows, space 10 apart, and one column, space 10 apart. Now rotate the array. Note that when you right click and select animate, nothing happens. So right click and relink the constraint. Now add distance constraints as shown. Add a new parameter, name it gap and give it an expression of 5. Change the expression of all the new distance constraints to gap. Now add 4 new parameters. Change the names and expressions as shown. In the array, adjust the value of the columns and rows. This means that for every added value of 10 to the width and height, you will get an extra row of holes. I created this CSV file in Excel, but you can use any spreadsheet editor. Enter design table. Select the file, and in the mechanical browser you can now choose from the various orientations. Simply select from the drop-down menu. Finally, insert your drawing as a block. Enter Insert, and select the file. 
Click anywhere on the drawing to insert the block. Select the block and open the Properties panel. Here you will once again see the drop down menu. Thank you for watching.